there are two universal languages. Food. That's so good. And music. This track is fire. My name is Matt FX. I'm a record producer and in-demand DJ. But my other passion is food. Oh my god. It's the perfect bite. Cheers, guys. shooting I am hurting last night was a sick party but truly great nights can be followed by some truly terrible mornings that must be Lauren my friend looks like you guys did some beautiful damage here last night how are you yeah? Always good to see you. I need help, man. Yeah? It's not good. Let's get well. you some help. I'm all chipper for once, and you're the hungover one. My friend Lauren is a DJ, and he literally throws parties for a living. Named a club called Rhonda, he started throwing uniquely flamboyant dance parties here in LA, and now he gets to throw them all around the world. I've even DJed a few myself. I know if anyone knows how to properly recover from a night out, it's Lauren. I got to bed early, I knew I would see you today. Made sure I was in tip-top shape with a nice smile sitting right in front of you. I got a place that might do you right. A place called Erewhon. I've heard of it. Yes. It's a health food grocery, but it's like the Louvre of health food groceries. Very well-sourced produce, health food, tonics and tinctures and potions. Any, anything that you suggest, I'm I'm in your hands. Apologies in advance, but I think that you'll, <laughs> you'll enjoy yourself a little bit later. All right, I, I gotta put some real clothes on. I... <laughs> Where are we? Where did we take them? So what is the deal with this place? It's for like the health nuts, but like the, the Illuminati of health nuts. Hey, how are you? How's pretty good, going? pretty good. How are you guys doing? Good. I've been better. Yeah. <laughs> Had a little long night. Yeah, yeah. a little bit, yeah. Long okay. night, early morning, something like that. Okay, yeah, well you're at the right place, man. We take care of you. Awesome. All right, so two things. You guys are gonna need that kefir margarita Ooh. with our Haas made coconut kefir. And then the shot that I recommend is that Gene Master shot. Gene Master has the uh, the deer antler. Deer antler? Yes. I know, it sounds crazy, but it's really good for stamina, really good for energy. There's also ant in it as well. Gives you the power and the will. Yes. Where have you taken me? <laughs> Ready for your recipe? Yeah, yes. let's do it. All right, this is the kefir margarita. How many margaritas did you have last night? I was about to say, yeah. man, the last thing I thought I was going to do this morning is drink more margaritas and shots, but... It's a beautiful right. thing. So this is our tocos, short for tocotrinios, and it's a rice brand. We use it to kind of puff up our drinks, and uh, it's just full of vitamins. After that, we have our xylitol, a sugar-free sweetener, because all of our drinks are sugar-free. A little bit of stevia for more sweetness. Got your omegas in here with the Udo's oil. Full of oil, it's good for your 369 omega fats for your brain to make you happy. It's our Haas made coconut kefir. What is kefir? Kefir is uh, probiotic coconut water. So is it almost like a yogurt? Kind of. Almost, closer to kombucha. Like the same like probiotic kind of okay. thing. Okay. All right, my friend. Cheers. Looking forward to the new you. <laughs> Oh, that's really good. It is really good. I'm trying to like put my finger on the taste of it. It's like non-ending, right? Yeah. It's Once really you think that it hits something, you're like, wait, but then it's salty and then it's like soury. It is coconut, but it's like to the next level. Yeah. All right, here comes your shots. This is a magical ant. It's really good for vitamin D's and E's. Really good for lifting up the spirit. Um, overall power and will. Ant shots. Yes, ant shots. Oh, that's gross. <laughs> We have this your deer, deer antler. antler. Oh my yes. god. And this is the one where the energy comes from. This is um, the deer antlers fall off the antlers naturally six months and they get them and they rejuice them and they get all the benefits from it. 
Um, really good for rebuilding the tissues in your body. Overall energy. And then we have your fulvic acid. This is what combines everything so your body can absorb it. Oh, man. You guys are all set? Boom. <laughs> all right, my friend. To my health. Uh. Oh, my god, it tastes like deer antler. <laughs> Whew. Whew. Feel it working? <laughs> I don't know if it's the placebo, but that that was that sent my entire body into shock for a second. <laughs> and whatever adrenaline like came up to defend it, like right. I'm already feeling a little bit better. Yo, Victor, thank you very much. I think you might have saved a life here. I want you to know that. Anytime um, you guys yeah. party too much or anything, come see us at everyone. We take care of you, man. Thank you so much, dude. Enjoy. Have a rest of the day. Cheers. I mean, this place is just so Los Angeles. Yeah, this is this is like align your um, nutritional chakras, and, <laughs> <laughs> and then you um, you know get some nice like uh, artisan soap, non psychoactive bath salts, some seaweed shampoo. This movie did something for me. I'm alive. My head's up. Like I can talk again. I still need real food. Have you ever been to Chago, man? I actually have not been to Chago. Let's pop over there, man. Chago is one of my all-time favorite spots in Los Angeles. Owned by legendary chef Roy Choi, they serve up fast, casual Korean-Mexican fusion right in the heart of Chinatown. I order from here every single time I'm in LA. How's it going? How are you doing, brother? What's up, man? How are you? I'm Matt. Hi, nice to meet you, Matt. What's up? This is Lauren. Hey, how, how are you? you? I'm Lauren. Nice to meet you. Likewise. So happy to be here. Like, this is like one of my favorite places in LA. You can see why. And it's funny because I've never actually been inside. I've always just ordered delivery. What do you like, mean? like, literally, I can show you my caviar history and it's just Chego, Chego, Chego. Oh, here. Sick. Getting a peek yeah, behind the up. curtain. I had a really late night last night. Yeah, I'm starving. Dude, I got you, so bro. So excited. I got you, bro. DPT with pork? Sounds good. Thanks so much. Man. All right, you got it, brother. About to do my favorite, favorite meal, which is the beefy tea. I add a little bit of pork. It's fantastic. I'm so excited to learn how it's made. Thank you, sir. We're going right into the walk. Getting nice and hot. Just gonna drop the meat. Prime rib? Yeah. Incredible. <laughs> Salt pepper mix. I'm gonna throw the onion in it. Chinese broccoli, brother. That's like the kicker. Oh, yeah. Ready to go. That's our soya. That's soya? The soya is not just soy sauce. Wait, if I tell you the secret, that means I gotta... Yeah. yeah. No, we're good. Secrets are good to keep, okay. man. Yeah, we're good. It's like I just order it to my Airbnb. I'll put on, you know, a season of some show, and I'll just be horizontal the entire time, <laughs> getting up every 20 minutes for, like, a bite. <laughs> So the pork is ready. You want to take a look? I would love okay, to. Cool, let's go. So look at this char. Is it grilled? Oh, the char on the meat? He does something. I don't know what it is. It's just, I don't know. I can't say it's magic because, you know. No, it, you can say it's magic. <laughs> you can totally say it's magic. I guess it's magic. smoky and luscious. It's not too fatty, which is a problem you run into with pork belly. It's on another level. I'm so psyched. Bon appetit, man. This is like the perfect bite. This is, it's just everything. Not too spicy, not too sweet. The beef is cooked perfectly. The char on the pork adds a whole nother layer of flavor. Thai basil shines right through. It's just, it's like perfect. It's a perfect bowl. I, like, I don't know what else to say. Growing up, I always wanted to order fried rice in restaurants. It was like one of my favorite things as a kid. And my mother would never let me order it. Because the whole thing was, when you go to a restaurant, you order fried rice, they're just gonna throw all the things that they have lying around. They're just gonna cut up all the scraps and throw it in. We saw fresh ingredients going in. This is real good prime rib. This is the opposite of things lying around. These are very intentional things, you know? Every single thing in this dish has purpose, has flavor. Whew. I might have to go out and party all over again today, <laughs> just so I can justify eating this tomorrow.
it's a really esteemable thing to be making food this good at this price point, you know, with this accessibility. LA is truly a city of extremes. You know, you have these $35 jars of yogurt, <laughs> and then you have these like glorious, glorious creations. 10 bucks. And that's, I think, where a lot of the character in LA comes from. Today we were like at one end of the spectrum, now we're at the other end of the spectrum. Yeah. We're still in the same city hanging out. 15 minute drive away from each other. Yep. Oh, man, I'm feeling alive again. Thank you so much for hanging out today, dude. Absolutely, man, anytime. I think tonight I gotta lay low. I think uh, probably the best thing to do is just chill and maybe work on some music, get a good night's rest. Best of luck and holler at your boy. Absolutely, man. Much love. Let's get out of here. I was a wreck this morning. That was bad. God bless Lauren Granich for coming over and uh, fixing me up. Air One was very interesting. The margarita was really cool. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna have any more deer antler shots in the near future though. Uh, and then yeah, Chago, wow. <laughs> that meal truly brought me back to life. Not every night can be a rager. Sometimes you gotta heal, you gotta recharge. I've been so inspired these past few days, meeting all of these incredible chefs, tasting this incredible food, hanging out with some of my favorite musicians in the world. And honestly, I haven't made nearly as much music as I wished I had. So um, I'm really excited to just unwind and uh, try to get some work done. just watched In The Mix with Matt FX. If you like what you saw, click here and subscribe to Genius Kitchen.